guys so today we're talking about the nail zinc very first spray can nail polish yeah i know it sounds really really strange it sounds a bit like one of those um uh spray cans that you'd get to graffiti on the walls Pretty much similar principle where you literally just shake the can you spray it onto your nails and then you can wash off any excess and then you're good to go so all i'm doing now is just going to show you how this applies and um, just see how good it wears the only thing you need to do is apply a base coat on beforehand and also apply top coat afterwards so let's get straight into it and see how this works i would actually just recommend just putting a bit of tissue paper a bit of paper on your table because the whole spray can thing might get messy and i'm just going to apply my base coat i think this just helps to make sure that the paint adheres well as you can see i've taken off my jewelry to make sure i don't get any paint on it I've given it a good shake and I'm just going to spray my hands from about 10 to 15 centimetres away. Don't worry about it getting all over the place because we are just going to wash it off. As you can see it looks very very powdery and pretty matte and I can't help but feel that there is a lot of nail polish that's actually just gone to waste from it spraying onto the um, kitchen towel but you know hey ho let's see how it goes so this is just one hand complete and I'm just going to do the other hand so just for a quick top coat before we go ahead and do the wash do bear in mind that I've allowed the paint to dry for about five to seven minutes. So we're just giving the hands a quick wash. This is just warm soapy water. And as you can see, the spray paint is just washing off. So guys, this is the finished product and I'm actually really, really loving the pink. It's called the Hoxton Market. It's uh, a very bright bubblegum kind of pink color and it's so, so up my street. So just a few pointers about what I found out about this nail varnish. One, it is great fun if you're with your girlfriends and you guys just want to have a good time playing with nail varnish and just experiment with nail colors. This is great fun. Number two, if you're not very steady with your hands, this is great because you can get a fairly good finish with this application. Also, I think it can be a little bit quick as well in terms of the time it takes to dry because it dries fairly quickly. I did, however, find that there was a lot of nail varnish that was wasted when I was applying this. You can't quickly just say, oh, let me quickly paint my toenails before I head out or the toenails that are on the show before in your shoes. I know you do that if you're going out for a girly night because you'll be spraying your toenails and it's going to get all over the place so you can't use this for things like that number three you need to be very careful about applying it when you're around carpet or around furniture because it can be a little bit messy number four i can't help but feel that this is rather a matte finish so if you're after a glossy shellac kind of look this is not the product for you. But overall, I'm actually really, really pleased with the results. I did think they were gonna stay on, but it stayed on really well. Um, so if you're up for trying out the Nail Zinc nail paint that comes in the can, uh, yeah, then go for it. This is great fun. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned to the next video. Take care. Bye.